Hi, I am Wale Beher and I am presenting my project entitled Moving Basics of Stem Cell Biology and Culture Elective Course Online. The rationale for the project was busy and incompatible schedules of the students applying to the course from the same or different academic years as this course was given to first, second, and third year undergraduate medical students. Number two, limited faculty time act as a constraint to repeat the course several times per academic year. And finally, limited resources, including limited lecture halls and facilities for elective courses. Plus, a great opportunity for the project was the existence of a successful learning management system that students are already familiar with, in addition to the worldwide need in medical education to shift from teacher-centered learning to student-centered learning, especially now, after COVID-19 pandemic, which has changed education dramatically with the distinctive rise of e-learning. This is my project plan outlined on Gantt chart. In January, the first step was formation of the project team. Then, writing the lecture manuscripts, which was completed in April, this activity was alongside revising them by an instructional designer for modifications, which was supposed to be finished in June. However, it was finished in July. In February, Lecture recording was started and was supposed to be finished in July, and it was actually finished by the end of July. Also, preparing feedback questionnaire was done in February. In March, preparation of satisfaction questionnaire was done. Also, introducing the course for the department committee was supposed to be accomplished, but this step was postponed. In April, Preparation of the assignments and supplementary materials was done and completed in May. It was supposed to promote for the course, however, this step was postponed due to COVID-19 pandemic. By the end of August, it is supposed to upload the course on Moodle. From September to January, the course will be implemented every other month and modified according to the feedback results. Finally, poster preparation and presentation will start in October and will be accomplished in January. Changes made to the project included changing in the course title to be more relevant to the course. It was changed from tissue culture and stem cells to basics of stem cell biology and culture. Intervention change included content modification and recording the lectures at home instead of e-learning unit as it was overwhelmed lately by the sudden shift to online teaching as a consequence of COVID-19 pandemic. Timeline modification included delaying introduction of the course to the department and course promotion. Lessons learned are resilience. One should be resilient, especially when the situation changes. Also, everyone should turn constraints into opportunities. And finally, practice is the best way to learn. Thank you.